Welcome everybody to a brand new video and today we're going through my rise I think episode 5 which we're already five episodes in which is crazy But I wanted you guys to take a look at the brand new evolution inspired gear for Adam Brown Um, I just added some I added the evolution pants granted they're a little bit shiny But you can see that there's some evolution logos on there uh, and I changed all most of the red to gold um, but yeah, so I just want to show you guys that and we do have some new entrance gears in which I will show you guys the entrance It might even be the thumbnail of the whole video, but today we do have to talk to MVP MVP I don't know what he's going to ask us about but he will ask us about something Maybe he wants us to join the hurt business who knows um, but before we get started make sure you go down below like the video subscribe if you are not caught up go all the way back and catch up because it's been a crazy ride so far we're the intercontinental champ where we have and are in the evolution the reformed evolution there's the tag championships we defeated the new day at survivor series so very very chaotic and usually i do end up cutting these load screens but i'm just doing the intro now so we don't have to do it right now as you can see my entrance gear though looking good let's upgrade right before we're about to start what should we upgrade though what should we upgrade? I'm thinking resilience, right? You gotta add the resilience just so it makes it a little bit more easier. But as you guys can see, entrance gear, it's looking good. Let's uh, talk to MVP. You've got some guts showing up here. Not really. See, evolution in the hurt business don't have an issue. Until now. What it comes down to is you chose the wrong company in more ways than one. And now that decision is going to cost you your Intercontinental Championship. That's some big words. And how is that going to happen? Yeah. One word. Omas. <laughs> you don't stand a chance against him. I can't stand up to him, you're right. But I, when it comes to chances, I like my chances against Omas. I'm not scared of Omas. Name the time and place, and I'll be there. Hold up. There's no need to rush things. Let's get to know each other a little better. Do our due diligence. What I'm thinking is, first you have a non-title match against Carmelo Hayes. Sound good? Sure. Sure. Doesn't matter to me. Because it's all going to end the same. Me walking away, Intercontinental Champion. Exactly. Okay, lock. <laughs> we'll see. We will. <laughs> Omos famous? Sure. Let's confirm the story. We're going to complete this story today, and depending on how short it is, we might do another one. Who, see, who knows? The interfaction action is moments away as Carmelo Hayes takes on Adam Brown in a non title match. Okay, I'm not going to talk about those guys. Uh, we're good. Actually, let's. Let's turn the entrances on. Why not? Why not? I need a thumbnail for today. Okay, Gabe, you know the deal. I want you out there for this match to make sure the Hurt Business doesn't get involved. Got it. Wait. Or they get some shots oh, in my on bad. you and weaken you before your title match against Omos. Come on, use your head. Gabe, you're going out there with him for that match. I don't want to hear another word. Come on, let's go. So I assume I just said I don't want Gabe out there. That's fine. But we do, uh, the thumbnail has been acquired. Um, but yeah, I just want to show this off a bit. Win one for Evolution and defeat Carmelo Hayes. Fine by me. This new gear. I'm really loving this gear, by the way. I really am. With the, the pants did look a little bland, but with the gold and with the uh, knee pads and boots it makes it look a lot better as we are really taking it to mellow oh you know what oh you thought you thought you could escape that one Carmelo oh hurting the elbows it's gotta really hurt Honestly. Although, to be fair, I am dropping myself on the mat. 
Oh, spear! Woo! Here we go! Let's hurt them elbows again! Alright, I, I will try not to do them anymore. Alright, Carmelo. Carmelo Hayes. Let's send you to the outside, my friend. Get up! Come on! Let's go for that crossbody! Woo! Whoop! Boom! Let's go! Right in front of your manager. Let's do it right in front of MVP. Okay, hold on. Oh, oh, jeez. Boom! Right in front of your manager. What's up, Montavious? Oh. Stunner! Woo! Yeah! Aw, oh, Matt. Come on, MVP. Oh, can I punch you? Let me punch you. You know what? Oh, okay. Not cool. Give me more credit. You know what? Come here. Get up. It's probably too far. That is way too far. Okay. Well, we're just going to roll. Oh, code breaker. Come on. MVP, I'm going to fight you. Nope. Don't think about it, Carmelo. Don't even think about it, Carmelo. Come here, Matt. Come here. Let me fight you. Aw, oh, you can't fight? That's fine. I'll just hit your boy with the Claymore. That's it. Count it, ref. One, two, three. After last week's preview, a huge Intercontinental Championship clash takes place tonight on WWE Raw as Adam Brown defends against Omos. Fine by me. Let's let's uh, turn off the entrance. Yes. Randy, all right. Gabe. Let's get this out of the way. I know you didn't want Gabe out there for your last match, but this is too big to risk anything. Yes. So I I'm going to be in your corner to make sure you hold on to your title. Okay. I appreciate this. I support. appreciate the support, but I'm confident no. I can win this on my own. Oh. Uh, well. Besides, you said I was the next version of you. Let me live up to that for once. Our goal in Evolution is to hold championships, and we do that by any means necessary. Yes, listen so to I'm Randy. I'm not saying you need me to win, but I'm going to be out there to make sure it happens. You know Hurt Business will be doing the same thing. We'd be stupid not to. Exactly. Look, I realize they have numbers just like us, but I know I can handle myself. So I'm asking both of you to just stay in the back. No one's going to think any less of you if you have someone in your corner. Exactly. Gabe's right. This isn't the time to prove a point. So why are we even having this conversation? Gabe would say whatever you wanted him to. Oh my gosh. I'm not like that. Yes, we're part of a team, but I'm a future world champion. The Fina, right? So I need to prove to you and myself that I can do this. That evolution isn't some kind of crutch propping me up. No. You said I could trust you when I joined evolution, and now? You need to trust me on this. Adam, you're going to lose your title. You clearly know what's best for you. Good luck. Okay. All right. Go figure. Come on. Let's wear down Omos. 
And since it doesn't say win, I can only assume that we're going to lose our my title. Which sucks. Oh, oh, don't even think about it. Oh my, bro. Okay, this is going to be difficult, you know. I don't think I've ever faced a man this size uh, in the My Rise thus far. Oh, oh my goodness. Just picking me out of the air like a fly. Okay. Omas, give me more credit. Oh my gosh. Nope. Boom. Big elbow drop. This is uh, going to be real difficult. Oh, yeah. It really does suck because I'm going to lose my title. Because Adam Brown's being a little stubborn. Like. Like, go figure. And then Randy's gonna get mad. And it kind of sucks how I can already tell that's gonna happen. Just because of the, uh, prompt. And if it doesn't, then, you know, good, good job, I guess, you know. Really faking me out. But, like. It really does suck considering I am going to lose my title. Don't even think about it, Omas. Boom! Oh! Jeez, okay, okay, okay. Omas, give me more credit. Give me more credit, Omas. Nope. I'm starting to get that one down to a T. Climb to the top rope. Okay. Well, this is it. Oh, into the ref. Yeah. Randy, please come out anyway. He's going to do it to prove to me. Called it. I called it. That's great. Yeah. But I guess I can't say I blame them considering it's my fault. That's great. Where's Orton and Slate? They were just heading back towards your locker room. Hey, what the hell was that all about? Uh-oh, what's going on? My... Where were you? You told us to stay in the back. Exactly. Remember? Yeah, I said stay in the back for the match. But then, in case you missed it, the Hurt Business attacked me. I could have used some backup there. Can we yeah. get some privacy? No, I want everyone to see this. What's your deal? Were you trying to send me some kind of message? Actually, we were on our way out to help you, but I got overruled. By who? Me. What? I've heard people say I'm a follower. That I lack killer instinct. That nah, it's game. back my entire WWE career. Huh. I'm done with all that. I made the call to stay in the back. I trusted you. We were teammates even before all this evolution stuff. Teammates? You've never cared about me or anyone else. Exactly. I Every didn't care about you, Every decision you've made has been to benefit you and your career only. Mm -hmm. Getting me involved in that stupidity with the New Day was a wake-up call. And then your stubbornness against the Hurt Business only cemented who you are. It cost you your title. 
but that hurts all of us. So explain why we should go out of our way to help you. This is ridiculous. Just like always, you're just saying all this because you know it's what Randy wants to hear. No, I'm saying it because it's the truth. I tried to let you do things on your own, and you failed. Repeatedly. What's next? You're gonna bring down our whole group with you? So maybe I was wrong from the start. Maybe Gabe is the future world champion in evolution. Don't even! Let's face it. You're not the lock. You're the weak lock. Fight me, Gabe! I don't nah. want you or evolution. I never did. I'm better off on my own. I... No! Quit. Good. <sighs> Clear your stuff out. I don't want to see you again. Adam... After I made the gear, come on, I thought we were getting into a group! I'm officially leaving Evolution, never needed them to begin with. If anything, they were holding me back. So tonight wasn't a setback, it's a fresh start. Headed to the top on my own. Damn, this night keeps getting better for the Hurt Business. We need to talk. This wasn't the plan. I'm sure it's not too late to patch things up with Randy and Gabriel. It's over. I tried to do what you wanted, and it didn't work. We'll talk soon, for sure. <sighs> so, since we last caught up, you got into a fight with New Day over a video game cover, lost your Intercontinental Championship, and then quit Evolution. String of bad luck, or all part of the plan? Bad luck. I'm gonna say how it is. It was bad luck. I had Omas beat before the ref got in the way and the Hurt Business cheated to take my title. But honestly, it's for the better. I feel like a, a weight has been lifted from me. Dead weight in the form of Orton and Gabe. I never felt comfortable in Evolution. But now that that's all behind me, I can focus on what's next. Well, I certainly believe in you. But what's next? I know I'll become WWE Champion, but something has been off since I debuted. And it's been holding me back way more than Evolution ever did. So what's next? I'm going to confront this issue head on in front of the entire WWE Universe. Oh. Former Intercontinental Champ, The Lock, has requested this time to address the WWE Universe. Yeah. Yeah. Let's be real. I haven't had the best run lately. Most notably, I lost a couple things. My Intercontinental Championship, and then my faction. But this wasn't how things were supposed to go, right? You all heard and saw the endless hype. I was brought in to WWE as the next big thing a future world champion and of course the lock it worked for a while but let's be honest it felt forced from day one mm -hmm. i never was truly comfortable with what i was asked to do and when it comes down to it these recent setbacks were just a result of those early decisions that were out of my hands and way above my pay grade yes yes what i'm saying is I was set up to fail by WWE management and especially VP of talent development Shawn Michaels. Oh, let me shoot with you. Shawn was behind all of this from the start, forcing one bad decision after another. So, HBK, I want you to come out oh. here right now so we can talk man to man face to face oh calling out Shawn Michaels Shawn's coming out oh no <laughs> I heard everything you said and I'm willing to talk but you know this isn't the time or the place. This is exactly the time and place. 
I want everyone to hear how you've mishandled my career since the day I got here. Stop! Now! No. I've played by your rules, but I'm not going to trust the process any longer. From now on, I do what I want to do. That's what got me here in the first place. My voice, my instinct, my talent. You and your corporate yes-men have tried to stifle that every chance you got. Okay. You really want to do this? We've heard your side of things. Here's mine. A.K.A. the truth. Uh-oh. All you've done is complain since day one, thinking you know everything. Like when you chose to drop your special lock entrance after one match, and then you dropped your custom attire right afterwards. Yeah. You know how much time and money was invested in all of that? It was a stupid gimmick. You never gave any of it a fair shot. But there's no change in your mind, because you're too stubborn to listen to people who actually know the ins and the outs of this business. The same people who tried to set you up for success, who wanted nothing but the best for you. Hold on. The best for me? Give me one example of something you did to help me. Come on. Name they one viewed, thing. Won the IC title. Okay. Let's get it all out there. When things weren't going as expected, I went to Randy Orton and MVP and convinced them to start factions to try to get you back on track. Oh, okay. That's how much we believed in you. That we were willing to stick our necks out for you. Whew. But I guess that's all stifling and setting you up for failure, right? You said they wanted me. Yeah, because I knew feeding your ego would be the only way to get you to agree to do it. But mm. even that didn't work. Because you couldn't learn to cooperate and quit. Throwing away an opportunity that everyone in the back would kill for. That's why I have one final thing to say to you. Don't you ever confuse potential with success. Because Ooh. you might have all the potential in the world, but it doesn't mean anything if you can't get out of your own way. Stop complaining and blaming everyone else and do something for once. Dang! Sean just... Do something? Is that what you want? Come on. I'm talking to you. Show me some respect! Oh! Breaking. WWE does not condone physical attacks, accidental or not, against its employees. Therefore, Adam has been released from his contract immediately. WWE official Shawn Michaels has suffered se several injuries, but is expected to make a full recovery. Hey, I tried calling you, but you wouldn't pick up. I'm here to talk. I know you're at a low point right now, but you don't have to go through this alone. Anyway... Call me back. I'm concerned. Three months later, WWE 2K motion capture shoot. Oh, okay. So we're doing some motion captures. Top rope move? Okay. Well. Oh, Cole Quinn! That's awesome! 
Okay, well, let me do a top. Wow, the disrespect. Cole Quinn coming back from 2K19. That's awesome. Who can forget Black Hole Cole? Come on. I need you down so I can start with the top rope move. There we go. There we go. Submission attempt. Give a pin attempt. There you go. Is opponent taunt this? It is. Okay. Okay. Crowd taunt. There we go. Irish whip into the corner. Come here, b-hole coal. There we go. Grab some weapon. Oh, I need to hit him. There we go. Okay. A heavy combo? What's my combo list? Uh, okay, so X, 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 okay. Boom, okay. Give us a light combo, so I'm just going to do this. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Whoa! Boom! Give us some strikes and grapples. Okay. How about it? How about a strike? Oh. How about this? Oh. Oh yeah. That suck. That really does suck for you, Cole. Don't do my own moves against me. Okay. At least Cole's doing his part, I guess. You know, doing the same thing. Yeah! It still baffles me. I was with Evolution at the beginning. I made Evolution gear because I thought it was going to go on at least a little longer. Not knowing, as I lose my championship, I get fired after calling out Shawn Michaels and hurting him. Insane. Literally insane. And now I'm sitting here doing motion capture. Come here. Woo! Whoop! Yo, behold. Come here. Oh my gosh. Okay. I don't even think about it. Oh my gosh. Cole! It's just motion captures. There we go. There's a reversal for you. Hit him with a signature? Okay. Sorry, guys. I'm sure you guys are hating on this move. But I think it's fun. Lift him up. Boom, baby! Mo cap a finisher? Well, you ready for a claymore? <gasps> Boink! There we go. Win the match. There we go. Wait, what in the world is this? Is that my old buddy, The Lock, doing oh. mocap for WWE 2K? <laughs> it wasn't that long ago when you thought you should be on the cover of the game, and now you're here pretending to be a WWE superstar? What? 
talk about a fall from grace. This is amazing. What the hell are you doing here? Maybe you can't afford to watch premium live events anymore, but I just won this Money in the Bank briefcase. So I requested that my briefcase motions be captured accurately by me and not left to the interpretation of uncoordinated losers like yourself. Wow. Okay. The same uncoordinated loser who beat you repeatedly? Funny. Oh, and look, I even have WWE here to document the whole thing. Remember when you used to have a camera following you around? <laughs> the irony is off the charts. Hey, how are you doing? You gotta love Sammy, dude. That's enough. You're here to film me, not speak to the extras. Okay, you, you can leave now. I need to shoot my part so I can fly to the next show. You know, the life of a busy, successful WWE superstar. Yeah. All non-essential talent, please clear the ring. Thank you. All right, let's settle into a T-pose. Mocap ready, position. Action on your briefcase victory scene. Great. Excellent. Now up to the corner, please. Sammy doing my job better than I can. That's fun. Oh! Oh! My God! Why would they do it? Adam! You you're better than me? Huh? Answer me! Oh! Yeah, good job, Cole. That's enough! Where's security? <laughs> Adam! Let's do this! Let's go! I should have sued you before, but now I am definitely going to. Let me go! This was assault, and it's all on camera! Get off! Yeah, me. yeah. You haven't seen the last of me! Actually, I think we have. You're fired. Again. Bye! <laughs> This is Sorry, awesome. Sammy. Let's take a break and we'll continue when you're ready. No, no break. Let's just do this. Make sure you cut all that out, okay? Why would you cut it out? You're gonna sue me. Come on. Should we wake him up? Yeah, I'll think he's got enough beauty rest. Oh, <laughs> what the morning, sunshine! <sighs> What's going on here? Since you never return any of my messages or calls, I had to come see you in person. You flew all the way over from the UK? I couldn't just sit back and watch you throw your life away. And since you're impossible to reach, I got in touch with this lovely lady. Am I allowed to say that? Mm, I'll allow it. Anyway, she's been following you around for the past six months. I knew what was really going on with you more than anyone. And we agreed. You weren't in a good place and needed help. Mm -hmm. This really isn't necessary. I'm fine. Seriously. I've just hit a bit of a rough patch. That's all. A rough patch is when you lose your keys, causing you to miss a blind date, and your cat gets sick. <laughs> of course, you find out the reason your cat's sick is because they swallowed your keys, but that's a personal experience, so we're getting off track. Okay. The point is, you've thrown away everything you worked so hard for. And then yesterday, you got fired from the mocap gig. Yeah. Yeah, and I had my flight booked way before that. You've been a mess for a while. I didn't throw everything away. It was complicated. But if it gets you two to stop, I'll admit, I've had better days. Mm -hmm. More like better months. So you got knocked down at Pega 5. All that matters now is how you respond. And when you're done feeling sorry for yourself, there's a whole world of wrestling out there for you to build yourself back up. We're going to the UK? I know you can be and show WWE what they're missing. Mm -hmm. You're right. I've let things spiral out of control. I'm ready to get back on track. Yeah. And I'll be right there with you every step of the way. Really? Got nothing better to do. Okay. I'm confused, though. Why are you here, Kat? I told you, I believed in you. And besides, I can't just start a project and leave it half finished, especially when it's going to have an awesome comeback story. And hey, sure hope. if you crash and burn, that'll be great too. For me and the doc, not necessarily for you. 
All right. We're at an airport. Where to first? The Lou. This coffee ran straight through me. Okay. Let's go down the same path as Bobby Lashley, Drew McIntyre, even Cody Rhodes. Uh, story complete. One bad decision after another. Oh, okay. We got a new arena. We got some new uh, outfits and stuff. Awesome. Um, but I hope you guys do appreciate the longer episode. Obviously, uh, it is um, it, the raw footage is going on for 40 minutes or so. So we got done with quite a lot. Uh, we've had a series of unfortunate events. We got, we lost our title, then we got kicked out of Evolution, then we got fired, and then we even got fired a second time, and now we're down in the dumps for months, and uh, hopefully we can make our way back. I hope you guys do appreciate the longer episodes. Make sure you go down below, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. The more you push out, the more you support these series the more I will bring to you. Have a good day. Have a good night. Whatever time is for you. And goodbye.